Hi all, welcome to our Vision Board podcast. So today I am investing a special guest, Adulya. She recently cracked Infosys and we will get more input from her, how she cracked and what are the struggles uh, in the on path of the placement journey. So that is the reason we invited to Adulya. Adulya, are you there? Ah, oh, yes. Yeah. Adulya, first of all, congratulations for your placement. Then can Thank you give your uh, like an introduction to people? So uh, your background, everything. Oh, yes. Uh, okay. I'm Atulia Sandosh. I am from Trishu and I'm currently pursuing my fourth year B.Tech in Computer Science and Engineering from Marathanasius College of uh, Marathanasius College, Kota Mangala. Okay. Okay. So coming into the placement session, right? So uh, what are the difficulties you faced in the initial days of your uh, placement sessions? So the uh, initial uh, phase was about, we don't know what to do in an interview. The lack of knowledge about uh, interviews uh, was the main major uh, uh, difficulties I faced. And the and how to solve is to watch more experienced people's videos. That's how we can crack an interview. We should know about mm -hmm. what questions they might ask and how to answer that with confident and uh, with correct knowledge about the questions and everything. And mm -hmm. uh, the major is the major way to crack an interview is to or uh, not always tell the truth. We should uh, lie a little bit about everything they ask, and that's how we can crack more about uh, interviews and everything. Okay. And coming into the like, what are the topic you uh like a lot in the throughout like how many months you invested for the total preparation? So, uh, the training and placement that our college started like about uh, six months and and we have been preparing about six months and okay. for Infosys, I, I, I prepared for uh, one week for Infosys only and mm -hmm. uh, there were lots of companies. So, it's about the six months preparation and if if someone who can, uh, who want to crack an interview, one week uh, must be enough, but they have to cover all the topic in one week. So mm -hmm. we have been covering the topic for about six months. That's why we needed only one week. But one week is enough to crack an interview. Okay. Then coming into the interview preparation, what are the steps? Right? Like what are the rounds are there? And how many time, how much time we need to invest for each round? Okay. So for Infosys, the, before the interview, there, there was a test. Uh, that's okay. S7 round test uh, we have to crack. and. Okay. Uh, had seven rounds of the first uh, round was about reasoning ability uh, they must be asked questions about relations and everything it's like uh, uh, a's father is b and b's mother is c and that kind of questions is reasoning ability and uh, it, it was about 10 questions and we we get over about 20 minutes to crack that questions and next uh, next round is um, mathematical ability and uh, mathematical ability was about questions like uh, questions about trains and speeds and everything. And we uh, they, they must give you about 20 minutes to crack mathematical ability. Then it was verbal ability. Verbal ability was uh, uh, they'll give us a passage and we have to read the passage and answer answer questions uh, about the passage. So we have to read correctly in the limited time and answer the questions uh, uh, based on the passage. Okay, okay. And after the, these kind of rounds, so moving... Pseudo code. Uh, oh. Pseudo code is... Uh, um, so people... Was, I think there was a network issue. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, maybe hello? you can turn off your camera, Adulia, maybe for some time. Now I think okay. you are audible. Now you are, yeah, now you are okay and audible. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, so can I continue? Yeah, you can continue. Okay, and then next was pseudo code round. So uh, I'm a person from a computer science field. So people, uh, there will be people in uh, electronics, electrical, and everything. So the thing that they they are always in the head of those uh, other branch people is that they cannot do a pseudo code. But mm -hmm. it is very wrong. 
anyone can do a pseudo code because because in infosys it is a very basic level pseudo code and okay. uh, there's a youtube channel i shared uh, with ma'am and mm -hmm. they will teach you very basic knowledge about those pseudo codes and it says we have to read thoroughly and just do the calculation it's it is it is just pure mathematics and if we know just to addition and subtraction and everything we can crack the pseudo code round Okay. And uh, yeah. the next round is puzzle solving. It is also oh. just logical thinking. Uh, thinking, mm -hmm. just we have to add and subtract and multiply some numbers in the puzzle. Okay. And mm -hmm. uh, next round is uh, grammar. Uh, it is mm -hmm. also a pure English, English, English grammar uh, correction. And you have to just know uh, basic knowledge about uh, English grammar, and you can crack that also. And okay. the final round is essay writing round. They will give about a uh, 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 they'll tell you uh, to write an uh, essay and my topic was uh, what is the secret to uh, enjoy studying that was my topic and oh. you have to uh, when we are writing the essay all the grammars and the sentences should be correct uh, without any spelling mistake and grammar mistakes mm. and uh, we have to uh, I wrote about my personal experience about uh, making studying enjoyable and mm. uh, I uh, write it with my personal examples and everything. So uh, I cracked that too. And each seven round has a cutoff mark. So we have to uh, score those cutoffs, cutoff mark in all the seven rounds. Then only we can crack the aptitude test of the Infosys. And, okay. and after how many cracking hours that, actually, Adulia, how many hours in these seven uh, rounds actually? Okay, this is a two, uh, I think, two hour test. And uh, we ha we can uh, go back to, uh, after completing every questions and answers, we can go back to previous rounds. But in TCS, oh. that is not possible. But in process, it is possible to go back to uh, mm -hmm. every rounds. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. So then because can, in the, it's, uh, it's also uh, online test, right? Completely online. Ah, yes, completely online. And okay. we have to be there on the uh, place where the test conducting oh okay okay great and but once you complete this imposes one round we can go back to also we can recheck in the question answers question and answers right ah yes but in the tcs that is not possible that is not possible okay yes. okay great then uh that once you uh, yes. uh like a cutoff mark you passed actually you can move into the next round ah uh yes the interview round the next round is the interview round Okay, interview round means it's like a two interviews or one interview. How it will be like that? It was a one interview. Both technical and HR was at uh, at the same time, uh, and it was a oh. uh, okay uh, one. There was one only one panel. Uh, uh, in in my panel, there was only one person who was okay. uh, who was who took both uh, HR and technical interview. Okay, okay, okay. How many uh, time it took actually? Uh, for the interview. Mm, yes, that means the last round. How much? How much time they uh, took actually? Uh, so it was a bit of rush. Uh, when my interview came because oh. uh, it was uh, conducted at the Rajagiri Engineering College, it okay. was very lag, and uh, my interview started at six pm, and they wanted to uh, rush the interview and leave, and it was only okay. five minutes interview for me. Okay. And in that five minutes, they asked, asked, me, asked me about my uh, self-introduction. And at the, at the time, they were checking my resume thoroughly and uh, asked everything about my resume in the, resume in the short amount of time. And mm -hmm. for uh, people who are uh, making the resume, they have mm -hmm. to only put uh, the, uh, the things they only know. You mm -hmm. cannot uh, put uh, things they don't know in the resume to uh, look good because they will ask everything about the interview in mm -hmm. my resume I, I i i write about i was once a math tutor in an inter internship and they mm -hmm. asked me about the uh, integrals and everything about math maths in my interview oh. okay that is also they asked that right ah uh, yes uh, and uh, for other people and mostly they ask about our project we have to know a deep knowledge about our project and mm. um, they lack uh, 90 percentage of the thing they ask is about our project uh, i put three projects and they are uh, asked uh, about three of the project mm -hmm. got it got it yeah 
and uh, sure. one more thing like and when you completed this one how much time it will took to, like and uh, like a sending like a selection result or something it's like a next day or like a one week of time so they conducted another uh, interview at kotayam uh, okay. in yesterday saturday and mm-hmm. our interview was on the wednesday so okay. after completing the saturday interview for the uh, students at kotayam they uh, released the interview at saturday night so oh it was okay. uh, very fast uh, after uh, it's because uh, they have completed the interview of the students at kotayam and they mm. released at na- uh, night hmm okay okay that means only it will be taking four days right maximum four days you got a result ah, actually yes. oh okay. great yes and second uh, thing there are no friends hmm. uh what yeah the, yeah yeah they'll come again come again okay if there are no more students after wednesday they might have released the result on wednesday night also Oh, so, okay, 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 okay. They need some time for shortlisting these things, also, right? That is the reason. Maybe it took uh, four days. And uh, yes. uh, coming to like an, uh, like an, for example, if you if we attended the another interviews also, maybe first round will be the reasoning or like an aptitude test. Then some uh, interviews yes. will be the group discussion also coming, right? Group discussion. Ah, uh, yes. And yes. then coming into a direct interview. In between, any other rounds are there? so there was uh, my friend who attended the interview of gtnx uh, company okay. so there was kind of a uh, role play round uh, oh. it, uh, it means they will give you a topic of some characters and we have to be that character and, and uh, have some role play uh, based on the character so that was a, a different round of mm-hmm. uh, placement okay okay i am also here in the first time that thing normally these That's are the rounds the, are coming uh, right role play role play round right ah, yes okay ah, yes and and one more thing adulya like for example if someone is uh, like an attending like an interviews so for example what is the suggestion you can do what are the topic they want to cover okay so like from your experience or okay. your yeah, so... strategy topic wise Ah yes. So the topic was uh, we must uh, first we must study everything in our resume. Then uh, the uh, programming language uh, we have to know about a programming language. Uh, it's like may you can be either C or Python. Uh, I will say Python is more simple than C, uh, but it is their wish uh, to select any. programming language mm-hmm. and we have to know basic knowledge about data structure oop concepts and um data structure oop and uh, there was one more thing i just forgot ah uh, no, yes sql uh, basic sql, SQL queries and SQL. everything mm-hmm. sql queries so that mm-hmm. is the topics we must cover we must cover those topic and uh, we must uh, know about our project project is a very important knowledge they are, they will ask every inch and detail about our project uh, then that time uh, when we don't know about our project that it's a very negative thing we must okay. know thoroughly about our project okay and this is a basic thing we have to uh, study pin uh, then a uh, basic coding uh, it's like okay. prime number fibonacci fa- factorial these this three must be asking. studied and even, they will even the and ah, yeah. i was also attended the interviews like in 2016 the same kind of question i also got but it was in the c ah, actually yes. not it python <laughs> so still ah, now it is yes. there right so that means basic coding yes. at least we need to understand yes then one then, more thing adulya any behavioral huh? rounds you faced in the interviews a behavioral round like they will ask uh, like a uh, questions like uh, give me one reason to reject you <laughs> that is a major oh. question they are asking so at okay. that time we cannot say a reason uh, to reject us we will say there is no reason about rejecting us and we are strong and dedicated and hmm. we will give you more uh, answers about our- ourselves uh, in a positive hmm. way do not give okay. a negative reply to any of the questions that is a major thing and they mm. will ask about uh, your weakness what is your weakness so that mm. question also should be answered in a positive way like mm. my weakness is like dedic- 
educating myself very much that will uh, affect me in a negative way but it will give a very uh, uh, productive in, uh, output to our company and that kind of answers should be given mm. to the panel if we mm. ask about those questions and another question is why do you choose this profession uh, like mm. we cannot answer like um and my father told me to choose his profession and everything uh-huh. that is also a tricky uh-huh, question yes. actually uh-huh. yes uh, we should answer like it is my passion and uh, how you like about this in industry and everything even though we don't like it at all we have to give mm. a positive reply to all those questions any questions mm. about give me one neg- they will ask about uh, give me negative uh, review about our company their company and we cannot say anything negative about our their company also also mm. try to give a very positive answer to every questions they ask mm-hmm. got it got it that means positive and maintaining the energy is the answer right ah yes oh, okay great great and finally yeah. adulya for example anything you want to give some suggestion who are really struggling not able to crack in the interviews and all any kind of suggestion you, because you already crack and you already place in a company so you can give some suggestion yeah. for them ah uh, yes uh, so the suggestion is you have to study more in like, there are lots of youtube videos and study materials in the internet like the and, and if you are going to crack a company's interview do study based on the company and their mm-hmm. previous year questions and everything and uh, uh, there are several companies companies and their uh, placement should be uh, very different and we have to uh, study based on that company and uh, their previous year questions must be answered before uh, cracking an interview and uh, uh, after cracking uh, the aptitude section and coding session we must be confident and we have to study every basic uh, before uh, uh, entering an interview and uh, try to uh, answer every question if we if we are not sure about the answer do not say we don't know the answer it's like uh, i i i don't know right now but i will be i am willing to study uh the give a positive respo- response like you are eager to learn more and everything and okay. uh, we have to study basic coding and uh, in companies who need, companies uh, which need a lot of coding and you can uh, uh, learn those coding in lead code and hacker rank and everything so those who doesn't like coding and everything there, there are a lot of companies that doesn't need uh, that much coding like companies like uh, who prefer data analytics and everything and uh, be confident before attending an interview and study more like okay. uh, we study if we give a little bit of, a bit of time in this interview and we can uh, we can rest for so many days and after uh, we get into the job we can study again mm-hmm. Yes, yes, got it, Adulia. That will be really nice, actually. Your suggestion will be really valuable for some of the... Because I got a lot of messages, ma'am, I'm not able to crack in the pressures round or pressures placement. So can you help me? So I think that is the reason I requested to give a podcast. So the people will be understand, okay, these are the process. So if you go through this process, you can definitely get a job. Yes. Yes. Thanks, Adulia. Thank you so much for joining. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you. Chris. Very nice to meet you.